a Vermont bog or whatever. I don't know. <laughs> Legs are super sore from yesterday. A little hard to find the trail here. But we're not going to drink this water. Look at the size of this mushroom. Look at that thing. Huge. Big fucker. Maybe giant giant puffball? I have no idea. It's crazy. You guys, this is crazy. It's like 20 after 5. And it's this dark. We're in this shit. We're still ways away to stop, so. Well, I don't know what's gonna happen tonight. All right, well, I'm, I'm gonna keep trucking. Good morning. Not really morning, more of after afternoon, but this the rain came down like crazy last night. Everything is wet besides my sleep stuff. Like, I just got drenched. Hold on, this ear's gonna fall out. That that was definitely the the scariest it's ever been hiking. I could barely see my glasses were fogging up and barely find the trail. There was this water just flowing down the trail. Just just stepping in the water, just stepping in it. Just walking through it. Can't see. Uh, I was like I was looking at it and fall down because I was going down a big big climb there so but I'm gonna take a little break right here because we're not gonna go far today because we're lazy today and everything's wet we gotta we, we gotta try and enjoy the hike New and old. Let's hope for no more rain. <clears throat> Man. Snows is just runny. Alright. That's the way we came, but... Going this way, but look at these beauties. They're huge. Yeah. Ah, the underside. All right, those are cool. I don't know what they are, but. So we might just go to this next shelter, which is like I'm two miles away. Call it a day there. Pretty tired today. It's been a long, long couple week, long week. I don't know, a few days. But yeah. Heading up to Glastonbury Mountain or something. I don't know. But we'll get to that shelter and eat some food and decide decide what to do. Stranger danger. Lots of people on trail. Long trail, Sobo, Nobo. Uh, I forgot what I was going to say.
haven't been feeling haven't been feeling all that well lately but looks like we're gonna go towards Stratton today and then camp somewhere around there hopefully it doesn't rain no more rain <laughs> uh, I thought I was gonna die that night Whew. that's a big old birch Golly. It's a, it's a dam. I don't know what the hell it is. Be beaver dam. See the water. The water and stuff. Crazy. Yeah, that's Beaver Dam. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Climbing up Stratton. Got some good trail magic last night and this morning from mud and solitude. And uh, his wife. Probably the best trail magic I had. <laughs> Most timely. And just the best. Alright. Climbing up Mount Stratton. Stratton Mountain. Snowboarded down here once, believe it or not. In a blizzard. I remember we took the gondola. The last gondola. It was like 9.30 in the morning. It was the last ride up. And... Uh, yeah, that was pretty fun. <laughs> Hopefully this will be as fun going up without the gondola. All right, well, that's where we're going. Oh shit, I gotta put my ear things down. All right. Hey. All right, well, that's what we're gonna be doing today. The Stratton Spring, oh yeah. Cool. I'm not gonna go swimming because it's a little cold. The caretaker. Cool, 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 cool. Stratton Pond. We'll be heading to Manchester Center today, the town, just so I can uh, get more food. Uh, I seem to be eating a lot of snacks lately, so I have, all I have left is tuna fish. <laughs> so, yep, that's what we're gonna do for right now. For mud. All right, we're walking toward Manchester Center downtown. There's the mountains way up there. Not a bad walk in mountains over there.
pouring out there. Holy fuck. Well, good morning, y'all. Almost 10 o'clock. Avoided the rain. Just leaving Manchester Center. Heading up Mount Bromley. That's where we're going. Sun on my screen throws on my face. All right. The old ski trail, or winter time. <laughs> Almost to the summit, point three. Way to the summit. I wonder if there's more in there. All right, well, there's that way. That shit's never gonna get dry. Oh. Well, it's Bromley. the AT and the long trail will go north back down up and down <laughs> just walking it's around two o'clock or so I'm gonna go another eight miles or so probably to a shelter area and just camp out there but um sun's coming out and uh yeah nice day so far humid sweating like you know what but <sighs> almost at the end of the long trail or the 18 long trail they're like the same ones for a little bit and then the 18 long trail split so yeah just listen to some comedy and uh drinking some water <laughs> oh I, I did a someone like left a peanut butter and jelly sandwich like with near these jugs of water that I, I got I used to get water and I ate it <laughs> pretty sure it was for us but i don't know it's just weird but i did eat it it was good all right so this is a mushroom right here you can see it bruises and my fingers right there just took it off but that's called a bruising and also if we just hold on i gotta break it look at that you see the color change the mushroom is reacting with the air, the oxygen. I think that's what it is, but. Pretty cool, right? Like, look, see a change? Yep, pretty cool. I'm pretty sure this is a bolete mushroom or something. Yep, that's in the, another cool fact I know. <laughs> Just random, random stuff. That's the trail. Headed up there. Oh yeah, top of the mountain's all socked in. Good morning, y'all. 837 uh no hat right now it's right there it's super wet still it's disgusting i don't want to put it on so that's my shirt also back there on the pack so right now the plan is to get to new hampshire on sunday night so that's about 80 about 81 miles from here in five days so pretty pretty standard and um that's the plan so it's about 15, 16 miles a day. And then Sunday we can just, I don't know, we'll do more if we have to, Sunday night. Because we're not going to pick it up till Sunday night. So that's even more time. My phone pad is on, uneven. <laughs> this one bothered me, whatever. I'll do, fix it when I stop to hopefully when I change shirts. I usually wear this until I get like sweaty 
but we're going downhill now, so I'm not gonna get sweaty. All right, good morning. Whoa. Cool. This is a nice bridge here. <laughs> All right, well, I'm trying to take this, the hoodie off. I gotta document this. Ugh. I'm not even sure what that is. Maybe fresh coral? I don't know. <sighs> Pretty cool. Took some pictures, so Whew. hard to hard to bend down like that. <laughs> Feel it in the knees. Uh, we're heading to some shelter in like a mile and a half. We're gonna eat some food there probably. <sighs> Just listen to some music. I'm trying to get some service. So I can download some more podcasts. So hopefully there's some service at the next shelter. I think there will be. Oh, look at this. That's how you do it. <laughs> how beautiful this forest is, the conifers. Spruces, I believe. Oh, heads up. All right, we're gonna look for a place to stop and eat some lunch soon. These are spruce. All right. Spruces are usually pointy needles. All right. Lunchtime in the rock garden. Now this is the rock garden. Oh, cool. I bet this looks like a bunch of rocks on screen, but. Whoa. Ah, oof. I cannot bend down more. Oh. What time is it? Three, three, three. A lucky time, but um, probably an, another mile to a shelter, and then gonna. Oh, sorry. Gonna decide where to go. You can go a little further, or find a camp spot, or go walk half a mile to a, a deli or something. I'm still. I'm gonna think about it when I get to the shelter. I don't know what I'm gonna do. So, made up our mind. We're just gonna, I thought I heard something. Uh, made up my mind. Uh, just going to the next shelter and just gonna eat what we have. Cause it's like 3.7 miles and it's too early to stop. So that's what we're gonna do. Just go to the next shelter and hopefully we can find a hammock spot. I heard it could be tricky. All right. Look at that sun. Yeah, the sun finally came out. Yeah. All right. I believe that's an airport.
Sounds like fireworks. All right, well, gonna keep on hiking. The sun feels good, the bridge feels good too. It's really, it feels really good right now. Oh. Oh yeah. This crazy area. <laughs> Two little mountain squirrels or whatever. I don't know. That's what I call them. They're like brown squirrels. Ugh. Oh, wow. This bridge is scary. Scary shaky. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Holy shit. This bridge is fucking terrifying. Okay. Holy shit. That's like a a real suspension bridge. <laughs> or, I don't know. All right. Now we go up, I think. There's the airport. We just went down, then over that road and whoop, up here. Whew. All right, I gotta find a trail. Whew. Almost to the shelter. This is what I look like after that climb. Ah, oh, disgusting. I sweat so much, it's crazy. Holy shit. Whew. It's a cool ass shelter. It's got a table. Good morning. Today, we will be climbing up Mount Killington. It's somewhere around here. <laughs> and then, uh, probably gonna do 15 miles to a shelter area. And then tomorrow, I'll probably go into town and get some food and go back out of town. That's the plan. I think that's what we'll do, because we have to, have to go. I don't know if I have enough food to make it to New Hampshire in four days I think, so I think I definitely need to get food so we could try tonight but we'll see what time we get there but I probably won't probably just go early tomorrow morning and get back out and hike <sighs> climb up a little hill Beacon Hill or something I'm already sweaty <laughs> and it is uh, <clears throat> it's pretty cool hiking up here because you finally get to know like the mount like the, like you know the mountains like mount Greylock, stratton killington you know because we're going up killington today and it's just it's cool that we i know what the mountains are pretty down south we don't know nothing all right there's two peaks one right there or the three it's like one right in the clouds that one and that one One in the cloud, and then that one. I'm assuming one of those is Killington. It might be the one in the clouds. Could be that one. But I think it might be the one in the clouds there. I don't know. I wish I knew. But that's pretty cool. All right. Let's get to climbing it. It might be that one over there. The one all the way to the left. I don't know. We'll find out. Oh, down the road. Another awesome forest. from that way we're still heading toward Killington but 500 miles to Katahdin <laughs> pretty cool take some pictures all right
That's a cool ass shelter. A falcon. A crazy view. We're, we're getting up there. That's where we're going. Is there a goodwill here? No, there's a, there's a goodwill, but there's a Salvation Army. Anytime I can get my hands on some shopping. Rutland, Virginia. Walmart. <laughs> All right, well, I'm going to cross this road. Back on trail. Really easy to go in and out of Rutland with the bus. Just gotta make it on time. Yell Deli was cool, kind of. Good food. Cool place. Nice day. So it should be a nice day today. All right. Car camping area, pretty cool. How's it going? How's it going? Good. You know where you're headed? Yeah, north. Two different trees. The dueling trees. That's crazy. Birch and a hemlock. So cool. We're heading toward a big climb at the end of this boardwalk. I feel it. All the way up there. Some, something. I can just feel it. That was Kent Pond before. Ah, uh, maybe that's where we're going. Somewhere, somewhere up. Just came from there. <laughs> yeah. Well, not the prettiest of sights, but it'll do for tonight. Yeah, the spot I wanted to go to, we had like no hammock spot, so I was kind of forced to push on and whatever this will do for tonight, hopefully. Hopefully you'll see me in the morning. Shh, don't tell anyone. I sometimes wear my hat like this, especially when it's cold. This morning was cold. Coldest has been in a while. Like, I'm definitely need to get some warmer stuff. <laughs> Maybe a hat, like a, a knit. But yeah, late start as always. The lighting is good right here, huh? Let's take a picture. All right. <sighs> Watched the Jets games last night. I uh, hope Zach Wilson didn't get too hurt. <laughs> He tried to make a juke move and he hurt his knee or something, so hopefully that's okay. But other than that, not bad. 
Gotta get to the trail. The lookout. <laughs> the lookout. Look at the size of that knot. Golly. Not supposed to rain, but it sure looks like it's gonna rain. Holy hell. Look at those trees. It's a sleepy hollow. <laughs> Huge wall right there. All these old trees. This road, pretty cool. Morning, y'all. Little after nine, leaving the shelter area. Uh, late start because we're getting going to New Hampshire today. Then we're gonna get picked up in Hanover, so it's only 14 miles away. So no, no need to rush. So why rush, you know? But shelter's back there, heading toward the trail. 14 miles. I think it's mostly downhill too, but I'm not not sure. I think there's like one decent long up. Like 1,500 feet maybe, but I'm not sure. Ah, should be a nice day. The mountains. Whew, warm today. Not a cloud in the sky, but it is hot for sure. All right, back to hot. Well, five more miles to New Hampshire. Mostly downhill. Can't really talk when I'm climbing up, so that's why I talk when I go down. <laughs> All right, five more miles. Hat's a little dirty, eh? Golly. All right, I'm all dirty, so nothing's clean. <laughs> Carnival. Fair. <laughs> it's wild. Almost to New Hampshire, but I got a, I got Italian sausage. The mighty Connecticut River. And then we did it, boys. New Hampshire. All right, selfie time. Ah, number one. <laughs> All right, now to go find my sister.